exercise decision making in your life. We make decisions all the time, right? Do we? Do we really make decisions? Or are we usually on autopilot, working by the same routines, the same rituals, the same habits, the same way that we always did it? Wouldn't it be more true to say that our default is this automatic pilot? that making the decisions is actually the exceptional part. And we actually only do it maybe once or twice a day. Maybe even not that. I know people that I'm quite sure that have not made a decision in years, maybe decades. You can see it on their face. You can see it in the way they live. You can see it in the way they talk. You can see it in their partners. You can see it in their friends. You can see it in their hobbies. I am saying... Making a decision is a good thing, because making a decision means that you have some control over your life, even if it is a little bit of control. And once you have a little bit of control, you might have a little bit more and a little bit more. And suddenly you will find that you are making a lot of decisions, that you are being more responsible to what you do, what you are, where you live, what you eat. You make decisions based on thoughts, based on emotions, based on knowledge. You make decisions based on whatever you want, even if it's just a whim. But the fact that you have made a decision, that you have clicked out of the autopilot, this is for your advantage. We have a blanket that is one side red, one side blue dark burgundy red and a nice midnight blue. Every morning when I tidy up the bed, I have a decision to make. Do I put the red side up or the blue side up? Now, I know it sounds stupid. I know. It's such a small thing. Blue side, red side. What does it matter? Who cares? I care. I don't care if it's red or blue. I care that I've made a decision first thing in the morning. From there, you can just go forward. From there, you can actually think about what you want, what you do, what you say, what you read, what you see, what you listen to. Decisions, 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 choices, choices. Sometimes, autopilot is great. There are full days that I go on, there are weeks that I put myself on autopilot. Especially if it's between projects, if you have to wait for something. Sometimes you know that it's the wrong time to make big decisions. So you wait. Then you can put yourself on autopilot. But my advice is, exercise making choices and don't let autopilot be your default.